Here's three fish where the males do most of the parental care, raising the eggs and the baby. One, the seahorse. After the eggs are fertilized, it's actually the male that carries the babies in the male pouch. The female's gone. The male is in charge of raising the baby eggs and the fry until they're old enough to be off on their own. Two, the Bangai Cardinal. Now in this case, after the eggs hatch, the Bangai Cardinal male actually keeps the really small fry in his mouth. This is called mouth brooding, and it's very common in freshwater cichlids. Saltwater fish, it's not so common, but the Bangai Cardinal is one of the classic cases. And then a third fish, is the betta. So bettas are what they call bubble egg builders. You'll see all the bubbles at the very top of the aquarium. And that's where they place the eggs. But if the eggs tend to fall out, the male goes down and picks up the eggs and puts them back up in the nest. That's his job to make sure the eggs stay up in the nest. In the fish world, there are many other cases of males giving lots of parental care to their progeny. If you want a coupon for 25% off on all Dr. Tim's aquatic products, comment with the word fish below.